Hey, ever wonder how those cool F-A-18 Hornets stay airborne for so long on missions, especially when operating far from land or their aircraft carrier? Did you know they have a neat trick up their sleeve? Aerial refueling? It's basically like a flying gas station. The F-A-18, both the older Legacy Hornets, AD models, and the newer F-A-18 EF Super Hornets and EA-18G Growlers are equipped for this vital capability. They use what's called the probe and drogue method. If you look closely, you'll often see a retractable refueling probe sticking out from the right side of the fuselage near the cockpit. When it's time to top up, a tanker aircraft like a big KC-135, KC-10, the newer KC-46, or even another Super Hornet, unreels a long hose with a basket-like attachment called a drogue at the end. The Hornet pilot then has the delicate task of carefully flying their jet forward and maneuvering the tip of their probe right into that swaying basket. Imagine trying to thread a needle while moving hundreds of miles per hour, thousands of feet up, sometimes in bumpy air or at night. It takes incredible skill, precision, and constant practice. Pilots train extensively for this, as closing speeds, turbulence from the tanker, and the relative movement between the two aircraft make it a high-stakes aerial dance.